Do you want to raise your own baby chicks? Today I'm going to be looking at this incubator. In this video, I'm going to show you what comes in the box, demo the features and functionality of it, and give you my honest opinion. The seller did send this to us in exchange for a video. However, all of the views and opinions in this video are my own. Inside the box, you're going to have the instruction manual, the actual incubator. I'll go over all of its features shortly. You're going to have the door that holds the humidity hose down. This is the humidity hose that they provide for you. There's actually two. There's a spare one in case one of them gets damaged. There is a power cord, a cup, and a spray bottle. The digital display shows the current temperature, the current humidity, the days left in the incubation period, and the minutes between each time the eggs are turned. You can change the humidity level at any time just by clicking the humidity button, hitting the plus and minus, and then hitting the humidity button again to save it. I really love the automatic humidity feature. Ours that we used did not have this, and this is amazing. You just put the end of the hose into the water and then the other end of the hose is set up like I just showed you. There's a wheel that turns and actually pulls the water out of the cup and then automatically adjusts the humidity based on your settings. So all you need to do is make sure that the cup has water in it at all times. There's also an LED light that you can use to candle your egg eggs. Candle. And they have preset modes for hens, ducks, and geese. You can also customize this based on your own settings. So you can change the temperature as well as the humidity, depending on what types of eggs you're going to be hatching. You can also change the frequency in which it turns the eggs. You can see here that the green rotates and that turns the eggs for you. You'll wanna remove the green piece once it's time to put the eggs in lockdown. There's also an airflow valve that you can leave closed when you want to increase the humidity or the temperature. And you can also leave it open when it's time for them to hatch so there's more airflow. If you are looking for an easy to use incubator with all the bells and whistles, including automatic humidity, automatic egg turning, a built-in LED candler, and a great LED digital display, I would highly recommend this one.